I want you might remember what I'm going to say now, but um, I've just been requested to try and uh, repeat the sick note, which I normally do at our roach rallies once a year. But, uh, I think a lot of you probably know it by now, haven't you? It's uh, about an Irishman who couldn't go to work, and he sent a letter to his uh, employers. That's what really it's related to. And it goes a bit like this. Dear sir, I write this note to you to tell you of me plight. Cause at the time of writing, I'm not a pretty sight. My body is all black and blue, my face a deathly grey. Should I write this note to say why Murphy's not at work today? While working on the 14th floor, some bricks I had to move. To throw them down from such a height was not a good idea. So the foreman wasn't very pleased. He was an awkward sod. Because he said I have to cart them down. The ladders and me hard. Now I'm moving all these bricks by hand. So it was so very slow. So I hoisted up a barrel. And secured the rope below. But in my haste to do the job. I was too blind to see. And a barrel full of building bricks was heavier than me. <laughs> and so when I untied the rope, so the barrel fell like lead. And clinging tightly to the rope, I started up instead. I shot up like a rocket, till my dismay I found. That halfway up I met the bloody barrel coming down. <laughs> now the barrel broke me shoulder as to the ground it spread. And when I reached the top, I banged the pulley with me head. So I clung on tightly grim for death from this almighty blow. And the barrel tipped out half its bricks some fourteen floors below. Now when the bricks is fallen from the barrel to the floor, sure I then I'd weigh the barrel and I started down once more. So clinging tightly to the rope, my body racked with pain. When halfway down I met the bloody barrel once again. Now in the force of this collusion, halfway down the office block, it caused multiple abrasions and a nasty state of shock. Still clinging tightly to the rope, I fell towards the ground. So I landed on the broken bricks the barrel had scattered round. I lay there ground the morning. <laughs> I thought I'd passed the worst. But the barrel hit the pulley wheel and then the bottom burst. Sure, sure of bricks rained down on me. I hadn't got a hope. As I lay there bleeding on the ground, I let go of the bloody rope. <laughs> now the barrel, now being heavier, it started down once more. It landed right across me as I lay there on the floor. It broke three ribs in my left arm, so I can only say. So I hope you'll understand why Murphy's not at work today.
if you, uh, if you had any push balls around at the uh, club house last night, that was uh, all from Dave. So thank you very much. You